Hey guys, it's me Jace and I'm back with another tutorial. This one is called Brienne and it was created by Jassy Slows or Yasmin Slows. Yasmin or Jasmine? <laughs> okay, well, this is a really pretty design. I love the center, the way those bands are um, sort of like overlapping each other. And here I used a two different colors also to be able to show the highlight of that. And here I also used three colors wherein the cross bands in the middle are mother of pearl. So, so that you can see the difference. Okay, this is the beautiful bracelet called Brienne. And I am going to be teaching you this version with the different colors so that you can see each part before you go into making simpler ones or slightly um, different color combinations. And of course, I made one that's beaded. Woohoo! I love it. I love it. It looks like a completely different bracelet. So it really depends on your style. Some loomers are already used to this. It's really very simple. Um, all you have to do is when applying the center band right there, you just have to have it beaded already. And I'm sure you guys already know how to bead. It's so simple, just sliding your bead and uh, sliding your bands in those beads. Okay, so let's get started. So this is the Brienne bracelet by Jazz's Looms, and I will try to teach you this. Let's get started. <coughs> so we will be using five colors. We have the Fairy Sweets um, hot pink. We have this pink. We have the Fairy Sweets baby blue. We have the Mother of Pearl, and we have the Liberty blue. I think, if I'm not mistaken, I haven't memorized them all. There's so many already. So let's get started with the cap band. Okay, we do a cap band first to start it. And then you get another blue. Okay, so here if you notice you have this and you have that blue. So the cap band and this blue right there. And of course, this is like how we start all our bracelets. You get one of the cap bands and loop them up like that and hold it. Then you will now add. The mother of pearl that you see those two bands in the middle okay so we are going to go to the mother of pearl and loop that and pick up the blue and then to close it we will just close it again one more loop so you get your first color again and then i loop that and pick up the last band and close and then you will repeat these steps at the other side okay so let's turn our hook around then we go release it and pick up the cap band and then close. Go pick up your mother of pearl again. Claim the last band and close and get the last band which is your blue again. And loop the two, reclaim the very first one and close. See? And that's what you have. Eight bands. <coughs> Ta -da! <laughs> so the next step is we will be crossing these middle bands. This is actually the start of the sequence. Okay, so from here, the first step is to cross these middle bands. Okay, and you will add one band per side, which are the baby blues. Okay, so you get two baby blues right there. So you get the first one for the left and loop the four bands and then you will pick up one and three. One, well, three <laughs> and one. The other way around. And then you close. There. And then you go and repeat that on the other side. Get your baby blue again and loop the other four. And then you reclaim the third and the first band again. So you get the third and the first band and then close. There you go. <coughs> the next step is to loop this pink that you see okay so that's the next one so you add one band <coughs> and you will loop it under these four right there so you remove the first two with your pink and then loop the four bands one two 
One, two, <laughs> three, and four. And then from there, you will pick up the middle two. So you get these two, and then you close. Ta ta! There you go. It's supposed to be like that. Okay? Now, you will add again another band under the four, which are these four. Which are these four? And that is the Sweets Fairy Hot Pink. So you get the Sweets Fairy Hot Pink, and that's your next one. So, you remove the first two with your Sweets Fairy Hot Pink, remove those two, catch those, and here you have to pay attention, there's a different style. <coughs> You unloop the first two first. These two. Okay. Don't let them switch. You have to keep the order. And from here, it's a bit tricky. You do not loop the other two. Instead, what will happen is you skip one band, which is the blue, and then you unloop the pink. Unloop it. Oops. Go back. Go back. Or oh, it fell off. There you go. Okay. Again. And loop this pink like that okay and then this pink next to the this blue next to the pink you switch it switch it over like this there and then you pull back on this pink and then you turn your hook down and you pick up this pink and bring it over this blue this is how it works pick up the pink bring it over the blue and pick up that blue from under. Get it? See what happened to the pink? And then you close. Ta-da! <coughs> Let's see. Let's just arrange it so it's not twisted. There you go. You've got the first segment done. Wahee! Wahee! Okay, so there. From here, you will now add those two Mother of Pearls again. So you get two Mother of Pearls. Those are your next bands. Okay. It looks like I'm creating a teddy bear. <laughs> or a face. So two Mother of Pearls, one per side. Followed by two of the blues again, one per side. Like that. So you get the Mother of Pearl. And then loop the four. Pick up three and one. Three and one. Close. And then from those three, you get your blue, that blue, and then loop the three and pick up number one. And then close. Ta-da! And then you go to the other side. This one is wrong. It's supposed to be the blue is supposed to be the second band. So you just arrange that. Make sure it's not mixed up. Just like that. And now you're ready to unloop again. So get your mother of pearl. And loop the four bands, starting with the first one. It's just twisted. <laughs> The second one, the third one, and the fourth one. Then you will pick up the number three again, and the number one band. And then you close. And the last one is you get your blue, you unloop these three, and get the last one, and close. So basically, You've got your segment done. Ta-da! See? You're now ready to go to the second one. So once again, the step, the first step is you cross the two middle bands. Cross it. Okay, cross. Now you get the baby blue. And loop the four. Pick up or reclaim one and three. You reclaim those two sticking out. And then you go to the other side and do the same thing. 
you unloop these four on the baby blue. And pick up three and one and close. Ta da! Okay. And now you will loop your pink in the middle four. And loop those four. And reclaim the two in the middle. And close. And then you will get the next fairy sweets pink and unloop it under the four again. So you remove the first two with your pink and here it is again. Unloop the two first like that and then you unloop the other side of that pink like that and then you switch this blue over the pink like that okay and then you pull the pink over the blue and pick it up from under just like that ha interesting and then you close ta-ta see And then you go and get your mother of pearl now, which is that one. You unloop the four bands and pick up the first and third. The third and the first. And then close. Then you get the other blue. Unloop these three and pick up the first one. And then close. Then you go and push to the other side. You go and get your mother of pearl. And then loop the four. And pick up the first and the third. Third. And the first. And then you get the liberty blue again. And then loop the three. And pick up the first one. Ta da! <laughs> there. <clears throat> See? We will do it one last time just to make sure. So, here's the last time. The first step is to cross those two middle bands. Cross them. And then you get the baby blue. And loop the four and pick up first and third. Third and first. There you go. Oh, my nose is itchy. Ouch, ouch. Ah. <laughs> when your nose is itchy, you just gotta scratch. You just gotta scratch it, right? Okay, so you get your next blue and then you loop the four. And pick up the third and the first. Now you go to the pink and unloop underneath the middle four. And then you reclaim the two middle baby blues. Close. See? And then now you get the other pink and then loop underneath the four again. So you remove the first two, unloop the first two, okay, and then you unloop this fourth band or the pink, like that, and then switch the blue over the pink, like that. And then you shall pick up that pink and bring it over the baby blue. And bring it over. 
Come on. Then from under you get that blue and bring it up like that. Close. Ta ta! And lastly, you get the mother of pearl again. And then you unloop these four and pick up first and third. And you get the Liberty Blue, unloop the three, and pick up the last one. Then you go and repeat the same thing, the same thing to the other side, the same thing to the other side. So, just rearranging, okay? So, you get the other blue, Mother of Pearl, and you unloop these four. Pick up the pink and the first one. Sorry, this got switched. These are supposed to be like this. Wait, get that baby blue out there. There you go. It's supposed to be the baby blue that's first there and then close. And then lastly, get your Liberty Blue and loop out these three and pick up the first one again. There. See? It's done. So, once you've reached the length of your bracelet, Simply get one of these blues again, unloop all, okay, and then you will just get these two middle blues, this one and this other one, and then you close, and then you can put your seat up there, see? And you're done. Whee! That is your super beautiful, okay, Brienne bracelets. The two regular Brienne bracelets. And here is the beaded one. So it's up to you how you wish to try it. But we would love to see your rendition. So this is the Brienne bracelet by Jazzy's Looms. And when you make it, please don't forget to hashtag Chase Alvarez. Brian bracelet and Jazz's looms when you make it because we'd love to see your edition. So I'll see you in my next tutorial. Bye!